Hey guys, welcome to the video. And as you can see, I have a DJI Osmo Pocket 2 Red in my hand right now. Uh, so it's on, I don't know why, but uh, basically we've got a case for the Osmo Pocket 2. Now this is the stock case that comes with the uh, Creator Combo. And uh, the uh, whatever I have in here is the, uh, the tripod that comes with the uh, Combo and uh, the connector for the the usb-c and the lightning port for iphone and an android phone and the zoom uh lens here uh this is all i have um uh, stuck to this uh package here and obviously i have the uh, buttons here and then the uh do it all handle all in this package uh, and i basically keep it just like this uh to go and everything and this is actually fine for me but i came across this product here uh this is a travel case for dji pocket 2. now we're gonna actually open this up and see how this actually works uh so let's see and uh, this is also a sample video of the iphone 13 pro uh the 13th just came out and uh i just got mine so this video is going to give you a good hint of how the audio and video quality is on the cinematic mode on the iphone 13 pro so uh, with that being said let's go ahead and open this up and so it's a pretty uh weirdly packaged uh thing so uh you would expect these this flap to go into the hair but it's not uh, you basically put this down and you go like under that pretty cool uh i'm gonna open this up and let's see so the case here is uh the box here is matte black and as you can see there's a you know picture of the device itself it's actually a lot bigger than i thought it's kind of, it's actually huge check this out so it's it's like the whole length of the uh what they do it all handle and then it's even thicker so not too much but a little bit i would say definitely a little bit thicker uh but um let's actually see what this is um there's a flap here and yeah i don't know what's going on in here but i'll let you guys see this uh this uh this is the cushion here uh with the silicone and uh basically your the original one has some like a carpet type like a like a microfiber type uh, protector uh, this one however is silicone i think that silicone texture uh, rubbery but basically this is how it fits in and it has the button hold on am i doing this wrong let me see oh it actually doesn't hit the button so yeah we're good i accidentally turned that on but uh, this is actually what it's gonna look like if you put your uh pocket two into the case and wow i mean it's kind of bulky and big but it provides full protection in case you drop it or something i mean it is a little raised where the gimbal is but it's, it's going to protect it well the outside we have this hole for uh, storing the tripod just like we did on the uh, older case Nope. Yep, the threads are just wrong. It's not gonna fit. But I do want you to notice is uh, it, it doesn't have a lot of space here, but there's a big uh, you know way to go with a plastic cover and then the thread starts. So might have something to do with that. Well, there we go. It did. Wow. So, <laughs> well, uh, you know, you gotta actually go travel a little bit and then start twisting because uh, there's a lot of uh, plastic on the way to go. So the thread actually starts a little bit lower than that. And then on the other outside still, uh, we still have um, one of these uh, clips that you can put on. I think it's, uh, yeah, so it's gonna be one of these, uh, you know, the phone connector. And then in the inside, we still have a lot more space uh, and uh, a lot of other storage to go. Now in the inside, we actually have a lot more that you can actually store because uh, it also has pockets on the sides here. And also, you know, if you flat open the flap here, there's also a lot of space here. 
I'm not sure if you're actually supposed to uh, put anything over there. I guess you can, but I mean, it's kind of scratched up over there. I'm not so sure if it's a good idea to actually put anything there. But uh, let me see if this holds up. Okay, so that's not magnetic. So one isn't magnetic. I'm not sure if this one is. No, that also doesn't hold it. What about this one? Nope, this one. So I guess none of these are actually magnetic or, oh, this one holds it. I think it's just a tension from the silicone though, but yeah, you know, I put my lens right there and then other stuff you can put like, I'm gonna just take this off to show you guys, uh, you know, things like these, I guess, you can put it in here. So there's one spot here. A lot of other things like filters and stuff like that, that doesn't come with the camera. You can also store them. You have one, two, three, four, five, six, you know, slots in here. And then one, two, three, four slots in the back here. And then, you know, you also have this spot to mount your uh, tripod. And then you also have this spot to mount this, uh, this thing here, or, you know, any of the, USB-C or lightning, uh, you know, connected for your phone. And then the crazy part is this one also has another clip, uh, which you can use to store. Uh, this is the groove here. I don't know if you can see, but this is the groove here. You can actually store that microphone. Plus that I get from using this case and not this is basically, you know, my entire device is inside the case one. Uh, so, you know, the handle, the do-it-all handle is not outside. And then I can carry this. I usually carry this in my drone bag. So, you know, if I'm taking a quick video, I don't have this at all because I'm never gonna, you know, go back in the car and then like, you know, go through my drone bag and then get this, you know what I mean? So this one is gonna be always with me. So that's a plus, that's a really good plus. And uh, it's, you know, if everything stays in one package here, it's gonna actually stay safe and with me at all times when I need it. Now the con is it's super bulky actually, you know, just compare the size, you know what I mean? So this is gonna be a lot harder to carry. This almost becomes like a, like a regular camera because now you are carrying this whole heavy thing, which is not gonna fit in a pocket for sure. This one does fit in my pocket. I always keep it in my chest pocket, but this obviously isn't gonna fit in a pocket. So I might end up using this more. So um, that's up to you guys uh, for a debate. Uh, which one do you guys like and which one do you guys dislike? Let me know in the comment section below. And if you guys have any type of questions about this device, this case and the device, uh, let me know in the comment section below. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.